is Nino. Yeah. Nino! Hello people of YouTube and the surrounding areas. Emmeth! Yes. We went to Disneyland. Yes. In I Paris Resort. Paris, Paris Land Disney. Yes. And everybody knows, what is the one thing you've got to do when you get to Disneyland? Go and see the dragon. No, shop. Shop. You gotta do your shopping yeah. when you go there. So in true YouTuber fashion, because we're totally professional YouTubers. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Mm. We thought we'd do a Disney haul video. Yay. We bought so much stuff. It's really hot in here. We had the fan on a minute ago, but we couldn't keep it on for obvious reasons because it would just, yeah, it makes sound. We're, we're... We'll just be a puddle on the floor. By the we'll end of this video. The, the angle of the tripod. I'll be on the floor, let's thank you for that thing. <laughs> Before we went to Disney, we found out about this thing called... The Photo Pass. The Photo Pass. And as being us, we knew that we wanted to meet a lot of characters. And it wasn't necessarily because of the rides, because we didn't really like the big rides, so we knew we weren't going to go on that. But um, if you have a Photo Pass, a majority of the characters have this, so you let the photographer scan the barcode on the back. Le back, as they say in French. And then once you... <laughs> Sorry French people. Once you've um, uh, had one picture taken and had it scanned, you can log on with your phone or your tablet and you can download all of the pictures that you've had taken basically free and it was yeah. it was like 40 euros I think it was something like that yeah it was like 40 euros to buy this card now bearing in mind there was a group of six of us going if each person would have bought one picture we've already saved money yep. and we had 33 pictures I swear it was 33, 33 34. Th yeah 34 including right so <laughs> we uh, we went on the Buzz Lightyear ride which is an amazing ride um, when it doesn't break down. When it doesn't break down, <laughs> which it did several times. When we <laughs> I think were on it was it. like three times. Yeah, we were on it. that was a photo pass opportunity. So we were like, oh, let's uh, let's. Let's actually get a photo pass on a ride. Yes, but what I have to do with rides is you get a QR code that you have to either take a picture of or something, and then you scan that QR code, and it's meant on the app, and it's meant to show the picture of you. But <laughs> for some reason, our QR codes registered to these two people who we've never met before <laughs> so we've got a strangest photo if you're if you're watching this these two people we've got your photos contact me and i will send them to you <laughs> well what happens if they then go oh actually we've got your we've got too. yours yeah I maybe mean, they have maybe but yeah this is the photo pass app and you can see all the pictures we've got i'll upload like, i'll put them over there, look, there they are, Emma. Yeah, all oh my 33 god. 33 of them. It's magic. Scrolling in an explosion. Star Wars type stamp. Holy crap. So it's quite a handy little thing. It's really handy, especially if there's a big group of you going and you know that you want to meet characters. For the rides, I think it was slightly disappointing. I mean, I knew that we weren't going to be able to use it a lot because mm. we were, just wanted to go on like the tiny rides or the, yeah. the walk around stuff. But like, uh, I just feel like there could be a bit more of an opportunity to have the pictures and to make it easier rather than just scanning the QR code they should have a thing where you go up to the person behind the counter ask them to scan it and they'll put it on and they'll put if it they on. do yeah. they just don't they, don't, they won't do it so yeah. I feel like they could have a little bit of a better system for the for the rides but for yeah. the characters it's perfect if you've got little kids and they want to meet a crap to the characters absolutely get one of those one. but just make sure you don't make the same mistake that we did in <laughs> when we got it we were like it's not working because we were like typing in the barcode on the back yeah. and we were like why is it not working it's not working so we went back in the shop and then we found out that what you have to do before you activate it is you have to have a pitch taken on it first goofy <laughs> yeah which was goofy for us and then you type the barcode in on your phone and then it registers it emma got this lanyard as well well emma's yes. mum bought it for her yeah it's so got it, rapunzel on it i have a very themed um um trip this year mm. and it was all rapunzel my birthday was mainly rapunzel your present was you're just rapunzel. obsessed with rapunzel anyway you obsessed. used to want she used to want to be rapunzel yeah. she grew her hair how long did your hair grow to four foot seven and a half four foot seven, four and, foot a seven and a half yeah if uh, if we find a picture of it oh my god there it is wow whoa wow. 
magic. I was absolutely bonkers. And it even has Disneyland Paris written on it as hey. well. Yay! And Tangled is a quality film anyway. Tangled is literally the most incredible film I've ever seen. So this one was off a lanyard that my mum bought for her friend, but she said that I could keep the card because she wouldn't need it. And it had 2018 on it and I wanted to keep it, which is uh. this one here. And then my lanyard came with this little picture of Rapunzel. Rapunzel. <laughs> we should totally um, do what Zoella does and go like... <laughs> okay. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, yeah there, there, there you go. There, yeah, there, yeah. There, yeah. That apparently yeah. makes it better. Yeah, yeah that's all yeah. right. Yeah. yeah, look, is it focusing? Is it focusing? Is it focusing? Is it focusing? <laughs> 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 on the back of the card, it has in French and in English written how to pin trade. Personally, I'm not going to trade my pins because no, I buy all of them for a reason, much. and I'm not going to do that. However, if you did want to trade them, you can. I didn't know this when we were there. You can walk up to any cast member that mm -hmm. has pins on them and be like, "I want that one." Yeah. And then you can trade. Yeah, I did see. I in our whole trip, I saw one guy doing that. Mm. I was in the queue buying something, and he just was at the guy, the cast member next to me, and he was like, "Can I have that one?" And I'll give you that one. They're like, "Yeah, okay." And they did it. I'm just going to show you our room key. So this yes. is our room key, and it gave us access to the park. And we also went to Buffalo Bill's show, which is what C2 means up there with the cowboy hat. That's that allowed us entry into that as well. Oh. And we had breakfast and stuff and we were staying in Hotel Cheyenne. It was really cool as well because all you needed to do was just tap it. It's not got a barcode on it or anything, so I presume it's some sort of sensor. It's probably just contactless. But again, the magic of Disney. Yeah. Again. And then when you scan it, the machine goes, Welcome! Yeah. Welcome. I guess it's their sort of thing like Florida has, you know, with the wristbands that you can reuse, but yeah. you just can't reuse those. But no. they're a nice little keepsake because, you know, it has like everything on it even has 25th anniversary written on it as yeah. well. But there is one thing, one thing that nobody had said to us at all was the checking out. You can literally just walk out of the fucking hotel. Yeah, as soon as you walk out of your, ho out of your hotel room with your bags, this is for Cheyenne. I don't know whether it's the same for every I hotel, don't know, yeah. but with Hotel Cheyenne, if you're staying in there, on the day that you have to check out, you can literally just pack your cases, just and walk leave. out, and that's it. You don't have to say we're going. You just walk out. So keep it in mind. Yeah. Uh, ask when you check in whether you actually do need to check out or whether you can just whether you can just leave. Skip off into the distance, happy that you've just skip been skip off into the sunset. You know. Yeah. Next thing, as you probably if you as you've probably told, we've got ears. Eeyores. Eeyores. I have an eeyore. You have an eeyore. Yes. Emma bought an eeyore. He's a little baby eeyore and he's really soft. Yeah. He wants to say hello. There you go. Emma's got some classic mini ears. Classic mini ears and I have got some special Marvel ones. Special. Special Marvel ones. And it's got Marvel comics on the back. Um, I got these because when we went, the <laughs> Marvel... What's it? It's Summer of Superheroes, yeah. isn't it? That was on. Now, I will say, I was very disappointed with this whole Marvel celebration thing because... Yeah. They'd advertised it as though it was going to be, you know, like they were going to have the characters wandering around and you could meet them and stuff. But literally, all it was, was they had a statue of Iron Man, Hulk and Black Panther. They had some posters up, some music playing and a couple of shows going on. And that was like it. There were like three shows. There were like three shows. And, and that... you had to wait an hour to get into every single one of them. <laughs> yeah. And, and that's like, no. that's all it was. And they had one meet and greet, didn't they? Yeah, they had one. It was Captain America. It was America. Captain America, but we didn't know. This is another thing that we didn't know. When we got to the studios, we didn't know that you had to reserve a space to meet characters. Because we were trying to meet Buzz Lightyear. And we got to the almost the front of the queue, and the guy was like, have you reserved a place? And we were like, no, do we have to? And he said, yeah, yeah you have to reserve a place. But you never used to have to do that. When I went before, no, you and could like, just... No, and like no one... I've watched so many vlogs as well, mm. and not a single person has mentioned the fact that you have to reserve a place yeah. to meet characters. They just go, I'm in the queue to meet a character, and yeah. then meet them, and then it's fine. So, but that's only yeah. in Walt Disney Studios. In the Disneyland Park, you can just 
meet them. Yeah, and it's how it used to be, and it's amazing, and I love that park so Yeah, much. I just hope they're not gonna do the reserve a place thing for the main park, because then that will just be yeah. ridiculous. Hopefully they won't. They had a little sign up next to Buzz Lightyear. There was, was there anything in the leaflets? No, like... no, not really. There was like a thing in the small print, but it didn't say what app you needed to download. Yeah. I've had a look on all of the Disney apps and stuff, and there's nothing, so I don't there's, even know Yeah, how there's an app you need to download. We don't know what it is, because we just didn't we, we didn't, didn't know. We didn't bother <laughs> after that. We were just like, oh, well, if we've got to download another app, that'll take a lot of hassle because you have to sign in. And then, nah. So we just didn't bother. But if you want to meet anyone, download the app, whatever app that is, and you can do it and you can have yes. fun. This is something I say is a must have when you go to Disneyland. It's an autograph book. Emma got one that came with a pen. Yeah. But I had to get my pen separately. I've had my eye on this book for months. I've seen so many people with this book. Yeah. And I just, I had to get it. And, and Emma's is a, also a photo album yeah, as well. Yeah, because you know what I'm like? I'm 100% pictures all the way. So yeah. next door to the um, autographs, you can put a little a little picture of, of the you. moment. Yeah. That was my first time meeting Mickey Mouse and I got slightly emotional. <laughs> it's really stupid. I'm 21 years old and I get emotional over somebody dressed in a fucking costume. Like... <laughs> Don't ruin the magic, Emma! We met 16 characters while yes. we were there. And Chip and Dale put happy birthday yeah, in Yeah, I'll thing, show, I'll they? show, I'll show. Oof. There we go. Happy birthday. Yeah. That's really Bless sweet. Them. Tweedledum and Tweedledee. I think they were the most fun characters they that were we met because as hell. they were so. How, again, ruining the magic of Disney, but how those people in those costumes can have so much energy. When it's like nearly when 30 it's, degree heat. Yeah. Just we were dying. <laughs> we were in shorts and t shirts. And, and we were, were still in, like, boiling thick. and they were in thick layers and. And they were doing like spinny things with people yeah. and like running off to the carousel. One of them danced with Emma's mum yeah. and like how how can they do that? Let's show off this. This is a popcorn bucket. Emma forgot to bring hers but you've got a strap around yours haven't yeah, you? Yeah mine's like a proper plastic. I mean yours is like disposable plastic. Mine's meant to be like reused. Yeah. And fun, fun fact if you take back one of the refillable ones, so not this one, but Aww. the one that I've got. Mm. You can get a discount on the popcorn for refills up to them if you go to the machines. You give it to them, and they'll give you. I think it's like two euro discount, um, which I kind of forgot about until I bought the popcorn bucket, and I was like, "Well, fuck!" I've <laughs> had a constant stream of popcorn, but oh well. <laughs> I can just take it next time and see if they'll refill it for me. I don't yeah. know if that works like that. But but if not, I will buy another bucket and get because their refills. popcorn is delicious. I'm so good that they didn't have any of the blue popcorn that I've been wanting. I've been mm. yearning for for like two years. Whether they've discontinued it, I don't know. They don't know. But this popcorn was really nice anyway, yes. and I'm keeping the bucket whether I can refill it or not because yeah. it's a nice bucket. It's a sweet bucket. Nice little souvenir. I got this little colouring book because I love, the, I adore this film. It's Coco. It's a Coco colouring book. Oh my god, Coco colouring book. Coco colouring book. Uh, yeah, if you haven't seen Coco, watch it. But when you watch it, make sure you have tissues on standby because it's so emotional and really sad. <laughs> the Coco section of the park, though. Yes, they had a little section in Frontier yeah. that was Coco, and they had like the decorations up, and they had a statue of Dante. I love Dante, and we had our picture taken next to him. Whoa, there it is. Whoa. I'm gonna stop doing that now. I've got loads of different like scenes from the movie and everything. Oh, there's Dante. Oh, that's my favourite one. That's a good one. Let's see if I can flick through it whilst also showing the camera. There you go. Got some uh, cool colouring in there. Cool colouring in Coco Colour Book. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they got one of Mama Coco. Oh. Do you want to show them your colouring, your colouring book, your sticker I've got book? Stickers. It's huge. Look at that, it literally fills my whole torso. Mm. And some of these stickers are so Aww. beautiful. I literally, they're huge and they're amazing <laughs> and they're perfect for scrapbooking as well. Oh, I didn't even see this when I bought it. So I bought a t-shirt from Primark, same as those little stitches. Hmm. It's exactly the same. I'm not joking, it's the same picture. They That's are. the same picture, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. 
movie oh, posters. Oh, they've got movie, movie posters. posters. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. They're like the classic movie posters as well. They are, yeah. Oh, that's so cool. And they're gonna fit perfectly into my scrapbook because they're the perfect size. Yeah, and is that ones you can write on them? Yes, this is what I mean. Oh, that's so See? cool. I'm going to show them this little coin. So these oh, yeah. are little coins that you, Emma got one as well. Oh yeah, I got the same one as okay. Yeah, Emma got the same one as me. There's like machines in, well we got this one from the Disney Village. And uh, they're little commemorative coins. This one's got 2018 on. There was... There was one with Ratatouille on, one with yeah. Mini on, one with the Fab Five on? I think I so. I think so, but yeah. that was the only one with 2018 on. Yeah. And when we saw that it was back in stock, because th the first two days was it, it was out of stock in the little machines, mm. and then the light came back on on the machine when we walked past it one day, and we were like, oh, well, do it quick! Let's, <laughs> let's see if it works, and it worked. And they were two euros, I think. Yeah, two which euros is good, because they're actually coin. like proper metal as well. Yeah. Not stupid plastic coins like at Warwick Castle. I mean, what? <gasps> I bought um, some goofy sweets. Wow. Um, Mum decided to get them. What are they? Are they like chocolate bars? No. They are um, like Mawam type things. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Like and they've, they've just got like the characters on the side. Hang on. This video has suddenly turned into a British couple tries French sweets video. <laughs> Oh, thank you. I've got a goofy one. I've got a Donald because Donald is Bay and I love him. Nice. Oh. Oh. They're nicer than Moana. <laughs> They're nicer than Moana. <laughs> Wasn't that nice though? I finished my They're very nice. I just swallowed it straight down. Are they different flavours, do you think? Or are they just. What flavour did you have? I don't know. It's like strawberry, I think. Yeah. So they must all be the same, the same. Fa favour. Oh, this is my t-shirt. I also have another t-shirt as well, and it's got Minnie Mouse on the front. I got it, it was matching with your mum and my mum, because mm. our mum's both got a Mickey Mouse one, and I got the Minnie Mouse one. It has Minnie Mouse on the front, so it's her face and stuff, and then on the back it's got her back. <laughs> um, so it looks like Minnie is walking. I just love this t-shirt so freaking much. Ta-da! It does look a bit gaudy, I will say, but when it's with dungarees, it's incredible. I also got a couple of t-shirts as well. I got one, it was a white shirt with Donald on it. And it said, it's like, discover the stars or something. Yeah, that's the catchphrase of the 25th anniversary. Yeah, so it's got like a 25th anniversary special one. And I also got one of Muf Mufasa. Mufasa. Yes. And it's a red shirt and it's all nice and stuff. Yeah. These are my cuddlies. Tom bought this one for me. I bought that one. In the one. Buzz Lightyear ride. Um, and I love him a lot. And he's really squishy and cuddly. Mm. And I bought this one. Because my main thing when we went to Disneyland was ears and then Eeyore cuddly. Because Eeyore is my favourite. My favourite Disney character that isn't part of the Fab Five. Emma got me this one. It's a little Groot. She got that from the main studio shop. And I got... A classic Mickey, like a steamboat Willy Mickey. Because I love, I love the classic Disney cartoons, the black and white ones. They're amazing. And they so, bought me this little Mickey Mouse. It's, um, ah, oh, it's the 25th anniversary Mickey Mouse in Simpson form, and they're little steampunk goggles. Look at that. Yeah. They're just so sweet. And then we both got. A Remy! A Remy with the Eiffel Tower on his chef hat. And he's got a little spoon. And a little spoon and a, yeah, and a little bow. Try, and it's really sweet. And he's adorable. He's got his little little teeth poking out as well. Yeah. Also bought this bag. Got a bag? Um, 100% definitely not me. I'm not a handbag type person, but I loved it. And it's really nice and it's really cool. To, for yeah, a gym yes. bag. For a gym That's bag. literally why I bought it. It's got like a little room to put um, a water bottle in each side if you really wanted to. I'm gonna move on to the pins now. So there's like different price tags. So this one is blue. If the green was the cheapest and the greens were were six ninety nine. Six ninety nine. That was it. Yeah. And then the dearest that you could buy, which I <coughs> bought, <laughs> um, were like 
1698. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> something like that. But I only got the cheap ones and they just so happen to be some of my favourites. So these are the first two that I bought. I attached these to my backpack. This one is an Avengers one. And the second pin that I got was this. It's a Pirates of the Caribbean coin, which is pretty cool. This one was the first pin that I bought and it's a tangled one. Of course it's a tangled Again. one. Again. <laughs> um, but it's cute because it's Rapunzel when she was younger and Pascal when he was younger as well. And I just, I love it. And I love that animated collections. I just think they're literally like the cutest things I've ever seen. Oh yeah, this is something that we figured out. Um, <laughs> Can uh, have a, a mini bow tie. Oh my god! See, I got a 2018 pin with Mickey on, and the two different parks because it's got the castle and it's got that she Mickey goes. water tower thing. Yeah. And then I also bought um, this pack because it had the Eiffel Tower on, and we saw the Eiffel Tower from a distance. But yeah, these are my pins that I got. It's got the Eiffel Tower, it's got the castle, it's got Mini, and it's got Mickey. And then I also got this little spinny um, pin because we were planning, because at that point we had met Mickey, Minnie and Goofy because Goofy was our first, Minnie was our second and Mickey was our third. Um, and then I found this pin and I was like, that's it now, we need to meet Donald. Um, <laughs> and so we did, so we on did. the last day, didn't yeah. we? Well, on the second to last day because the last day we were travelling. But um, So it kind of... Made me feel a little bit better about myself because I bought a pin that was actually useful. <laughs> and I also, oh, I've seen these in people's vlogs. Ooh. Um, and they collect them as and when they go to the different hotels, which is sort of what I want to do. However, part of me knows I'm never going to want to go to any <laughs> other Disney hotel other than the Cheyenne. Cheyenne because it was, was incredible. amazing. Um, and it's a little um, badge that has your room key on. <laughs> Not your room key on, but a room key on, which is meant to be your room key. And it's got Hotel Cheyenne or Hotel Disney etc etc. Depending on what Depending hotel on you visit. Which one you got? <laughs> this was the one after I got the first two I showed you. It's Baymax because I love Baymax. And then I got, these are the last two that I got. As I said before I like the um, black and white cartoons. So I got a Steamboat Willy pin. Willy. Let's see. Willy. <laughs> And then this was the last one I got. I thought this was a nice way to sort of finish off the holiday. I got one of Walt Disney and he's he's in a frame of like a lot of the characters which is really cool. I think it's like Mickey dressed up as different characters because there's a yeah, Robin Hood. Yeah it is. In all like the original Disney cartoons with just, yeah. just like Mickey, Goofy, Minnie that sort of thing. Yeah. The last thing that I bought on this trip was a ring which isn't very me is it really I'm not I'm not very girly but mm. I had seen these rings like all throughout the trip and I thought fuck it we've got 10 minutes before we need to be in the train station I'm gonna go to a shop and it's got Mickey ears on it Power Rangers yeah! I don't know if it will show up on the camera because I couldn't take a picture of it <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. like, guys 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 look at my guys, ring guys 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 <laughs> and then also I knew that I wanted to get this because Tom bought me a little Disney Pandora char 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 chain mm. and charm for Christmas. And I knew that I wanted to get a charm from this Disneyland park. And I saw this one with the castle and fireworks and it has a purple firework on which is my favourite colour. Yeah. And this is one of the exclusive ones and I think they're going to be discontinuing it. Um, Aww. But yeah, that's that's it. Lovely. I've got two. Oh. <laughs> You've got six ears. Yeah. Thank you very much for watching this little video. Um, if we're going to. I'm going to take that off, that's uncomfortable. <laughs> if you're going to Disneyland Paris, have a great time. Because oh we my did. God, it's literally the most beautiful place I've... on earth. <laughs> it's my favourite place. Like. Ever. Hands down. There is no place better than Disneyland Paris. Mm -hmm. Or. Disneyland in general, I'm sure that their other parks are beautiful as well. And now I want to go to all of them! I want to go to America. So thank you very much for watching this little video. Yeah. We will see you in a future video. video. Go. 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 Goodbye people! Bye. Bye. See you later. Bye. See you later <laughs>
Vemos.